this is the very end of the Sawmill Creek extension. Now we're heading in towards the, the Corte. This is pretty bumpy too. And I just put a lot of air in the tube. I don't want to pinch flat. I really don't think I need as much air as I have in there, but I just put it in to be safe. Now there's the trail to my left, you know, the White Rock Trail, where I rode up on the wall last week. But this is, this is more fun because we're down by the water. See right out there, huh? It's a great shot through the uh, through the bushes. Just switch the camera over to uh, photo mode. Want to get a shot of the, the, the ice there? Here we go. Back on track. Okay, so boy, I started off like in a stellar ride, having so much fun. Then I put a slight damper. So I'm gonna try. I'm building up, getting that excitement back. I got 99% of it back. Just so happy everything worked out and I continued my ride. Let alone, let alone, you know, having to deal with walking home or calling a car. Look at the size of him. So now, what is that? What is that? What is that? What kind of bird is that? That's duck. Yeah, they're just all out there on the ice. I wonder what that's about. The birds sitting out on the ice out there. Are they finding... Are they finding fish under the water or something? Why the heck would they be out there on the ice? It's a good question to, to research. Yes, I love it out here. I love it out here. Say it a third time. The Meadowlands. Coming up on, I guess we have a little ways to go before we cross the rocks. All right, this smooths out of here. This is real nice in here. And there's that log I love so much right there to the right in the water, but it's frozen with ice on it. That was my favorite view last time I took a shot when it was cold. Right, two rides back. Started at 18 degrees. The high of the day on the ride was 24, and that's how I finished up, 24 degrees. I remember looking, you know, over there, I was on the other trail to my left. It was 24 degrees, now it's 43. different than being down like a sandy hook at the beach. I got all the same stuff here, right in my backyard. I 
don't know the uh, sections of the trails by looking at the towers. Like right here, you have the tower on the left and right. That's like an indicator of where I'm at on the trail. So that, so that would be an indicator of getting up close, you know, to the rock crossing it. Discover America way up there. Let's get a shot of that. Okay, so here's the rock crossing up here. And yeah, the tide is really out. Beautiful. Just like I wanted it to be. Well, I think, right? So... I'm just ready to ride across that, but I'm, I'm seeing now that it gets really deep. All right, so we can walk in the water. I got my boots on. I'm going to be careful. The bike doesn't slide as I lean on it like it did the other time. <laughs> Coming up here. That was one of the cold, cold days. And my hand and arm went in the water. I pulled it out very quickly. Um, so I really didn't have a chance to go all the way through. So what I had on was kind of water resistant, helped a bit. Yeah, no, so the tides, it looks like it's, is it going backwards? Because the rocks are getting higher up. I don't even know if I can cross up here now. Oh boy, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to cross. Look at this. I don't think I'm going to be able to cross. Look at that. Because even if I got up there, I'm not going to be able to get across the damn thing here. Look at this. Oh, that's awful. This is awful. Now that put a damper. That's put a damper on my ride. So this is that little trail. You can see kind of through the, I call this straw. It looks like straw, these bushes, all the dried up winter cattail. But this is how I get across when I go across the rocks. The tide was, the tide was in too much. I couldn't get, I couldn't get back to the corte like I wanted to. So I guess I'm stuck on this this end of the Meadowlands, which is okay. And I'm just going to do a loop out here on the. I think I'm going to go. I'm going to do a loop out here in the White Rock section and head back. Um, we'll see where I want to go, but I can't go through the corte section. So this is riding up. So this riding on the rock. Well, I guess it's, it's all kind of similar, right? It's loose. There's not those big, those those twigs or the uh, shrubs. The shrubs are like cut down, and the, the lower parts who are really firm. That's what's sticking up. Back on this is just real loose, real gravelly stones here. I see this too high, I'm not going to be able to get through. I don't think I'm going to be able to get through up here. Maybe I can if I get my head down low enough. Yeah, be able to get through there. Oh, so instead of going down, went down the last time, we're going to continue up here. Go right to the end of it. I think that's the first time I've done that. That's pretty neat. So out here, so I'm gonna get away from the water, a little different. I just like this, this wheat color, right? This, 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 you know, I call it wheat. This golden, light brown, yellowish. I think it's just awesome. It's an awesome color. Silly, real windy over here. I'm dressed a little bit lighter today, but I'm okay. Get some body heat going. All right, so there's another wall up here. I think this might be too. I don't know if we can ride on here. Let's see. 
this has those twigs get again right that take my front wheel like on the when I was on the fat bike don't want to get too far over on the off camber because you're going to slide down there Hear all the twigs. You really got to plow through them, like power through them. Yeah, this is so now. It's not bad here. A little stressful when you get those twigs. Oh, there's a big branch down. There's no way to get around that. Oh, almost though. <laughs> almost. Well, actually. You could just about. That'd be a good if you can get across that. That's a uh, and it's all off camber if you if you miss to the right there. All right, so we're gonna continue up here. Now I, I've never I did I did this. Listen, I can't even talk. I did this on the fat bike. I've never on in the on the other end. Never been over here. Low branch here. Low section there. Look at this, all this wall riding down here. Wow, see I've never done so now. There's just so many things out here. George, there's so many things out here to do. There really is. You know, you're throwing all this stuff here. This is the first, but as I keep finding these things that I never thought about doing before, I'm up in the air here. Riding on the gravel. A little bit off camber there. Real windy. That's getting real windy. A gusty. Hopefully you can't hear it with the cover I have on the GoPro. So what happens when we get up here? This is where I get all those shrubs. All the shrubs. Yeah, every now and then I get like the anxiety because it gets look at the deer. Look at them. Can you see them hopping through? So they were up over to the right. I wonder what they're doing in there. I think the water so no, well the water is out of ways. Look how long this goes. So I can't get across these rocks. Nope. Now, could you? Yeah, that, that would be uh, yeah, too much. I know I ride on those kind of rocks, right? When I go through the, uh, the Lindhurst Recreational Center. I wonder how long this is gonna go. I know, see this is here, it's like a retaining wall of, of sorts. This was all, you know, put together man-made to, help keep out you know the toxins from the old garbage over the, the damn 10 years or so that, that trail was out here Look at this goes for a long way I better get comfortable if I want to ride this relax a little bit yeah never even thought about riding up here over here Never thought about it. But you don't want to get too off camber. Oh. They want to get too off camber and start slipping down those rocks. That's the key. So 
trying to stay up as much as close as I can to the top. A little slower, a little slower riding up here, but get a nice view out to my right. So now I feel like I'm more surrounded by the water. I got to ride up on this wall. Very windy. So I think I would think that this would I mean, we have these shrubs again. Gotta remember to push through them. Remember I have a, a tube in the front. section I gotta get through. Give me a chance to rest my hands. Ah. So they throw these rock sections in every now and then. I don't know what that's all about. There's some significance to that. There's rocks all along the right. All has to do with, you know, these branches are tricky. Yeah, these branches are tricky. Yeah, these branches are real tricky. They don't seem to be as bad as they were that throat that day when it was 24 degrees out here. So what's happening up here? What is this here? So if I, if I wanted to continue to ride on the wall, is that a bridge of sorts over there? Wait a minute. Is that some kind of a bridge up there? <laughs> well, that's the end of the wall. Let's see. Can I ride on the off camber here? Let's see. No, that's going to be too much. All right. So that's it. So we come up to there. That was a long way. That was a long way. So we would come around. So the key is to go down and ride across those rocks and continue. So we're going to try that. Get up here, go down, ride across those rocks and get across. I gotta keep pedaling hard across those suckers. Get my foot in here. Yeah. Yeah. I made the rocks, but I put I made the rocks but getting up here. So I think the key would be to make the rocks and go straight and then find your way up here. That would be how you do it. The retaining wall is way out there to the right, but you can't ride on that. So we're right up here. Yeah. So much out here in the metal lanes. So much. Oh, the wall that continues up there. On. All right. I 
can't go through here. That felt a little sketchy, but it's okay. So can I get back up there? I'm not going to be able to ride over there. I'm not going to be able to ride to get up. I'm going to have to just get over here. Let's see if I can get up here. This has tons of shrubbery that, you know, you can see the shrubs on the ground. Let's see. I guess you, you, like you, you prepare for, for going through them, right? There's a different... This is here. Keeping the wheel straight. Trying to keep it straight. Here. You're crackling, right? They go across then. Oh, I'm up on the end already. So maybe, maybe the fat tire felt more difficult because you know the force of the this, the uh, shrub there or pushed out and I, I, I'm you're not able to you're not able to get through all these easily. This is all sketchy through here. With all these rocks. <laughs> you see I went off there. Yeah. <laughs> that was tricky. Get back in here. Some bicycle fun. I, I never thought to ride up on this this wall it goes like all the way around. It, it's challenging because you slip down. This is loose and it's tricky. I know. I, know. Huh. I go my dog on the I mean, I, I go. There's so many trails in here. I mean, yeah. it's all private property. Nobody bothers you. You, you know, you don't hurt anything. But it goes all around, yeah. and then along the water it goes. Oh, okay, that's smart. Yeah, I, I've been riding a bike in here if I could. I found this place about a year ago. I live over in Nutley, just about four or five miles over. Yeah. And there's so many places to ride in here. You know, walk, hike. I love this this straw, the the, the yellow color, the brown. Yeah, so, uh, uh, maybe five, six years ago, a lot of rabbits over there. Now a lot of what? Rabbit. A rabbit? Yeah, I don't see any rabbits. No, you see, you got the dogs. In oh, hello, beagles. Yes, hello, fellas. Hello. I'm a bicycle. I'm riding my bicycle today. Yeah. I'm riding a bicycle. Yes. I'm riding my bicycle. I love that. I love dogs. All right, that was Tony. That was a fun chat. That was a fun chat. Yeah, so this is so different. So we did the whole the whole length of this trail, we did it on the wall. <laughs> the whole length of the trail. This is quite loose here. Yeah, so you heard Tony, he parks over here, puts his phone number 
on the car. Somebody wants to call him and tell him that he has to leave. Yeah. Yeah. This one's for you, George. This one's for you. Oh, that was tough, George. Yeah, that was tough. I think I'm, I never thought about it, well, not often, but I'm better turning to my left, right? That was me turning to my right. All right, so how do I want to go here? Let's think about this. <laughs> 